Welcome, my name is Katie, I'm a wife, I'm a mom, I work full time and I love makeup and skincare. I truly believe every single woman wants to look and feel her best and I have the tools and the resources to help you get there. And it was so funny because yesterday I was filming some content and I was like, man, I feel like I got the liquid shadow in it. There's not the liquid shadow. I just put liquid shadow on my lids, but excuse me. I feel like I got the liquid foundation in another shade. Like, I feel like I just ordered it in another shade that I haven't tried before. So I actually did. I have a whole drawer of product that I specifically, when it's new and I've never tried it before, I put it in that drawer. And I know then that I have to do a video on it for YouTube because I've never done a video on it before if it's in that drawer. So here we are. Today I'm gonna to be wearing the Mineral Touch Liquid Foundation in the shade Eyelet. This is very, very similar to the shade that I normally wear, which is Taffeta. It's just Taffeta has like a little bit more of like a yellow to it, and Eyelet's a little bit more neutral. So I've been wanting to try this because I got this spray foundation in Eyelet this summer as a new shade that I had never gotten in the spray foundation before, but you all know if you've watched any of my videos, the Mineral Touch Liquid Foundation is my number one favorite unique product. It is Photoshop in a bottle. So this is a brand new bottle. I'm gonna drain the dropper, and I really wanna make sure that I shake it up really, really, really well, because it's the first time that I'm using it, because I just found it in the drawer. Oh, I cracked myself up. Anyway, uh, one thing before we get started, I did go ahead and I put on my Touch Glorious Face Primer first. Did you know whatever you have left on your hands, you can actually run it through your hair to help smooth your hair? Just a little tip for you for the day. <laughs> I cracked myself up, cracked myself up. Okay, so I bought this super cheap kimono. It says Maid of Honor on it, which I was a Maid of Honor for my cousin, so it's not a lie. It's just I wanted something cheap that I could throw on my lap because look at this, you all. This is how often I spell found spill foundation on my pants so now I just spill it on the kimono that I got for super cheap off Amazon <laughs> I wear it like an apron <sighs> I mean I could wear it wear it but then you just see this bright purple all the time on my body and I just I like to wear different shirts this is my Indianapolis 500 shirt so I did a 500 mile challenge this summer it was virtual and now I'm doing the Gump Challenge, which is across the United States. It's 3,009 miles across the United States, and it's all virtual. So I just go in and I log my miles, but this is the shirt I got when I did the 500. Anyway, look at this. This may be, do you think this will be my go-to instead of taffeta? I don't know. I'm going to have to take a picture and see. Sometimes it's hard when I have the ring light to really see what the color looks like. And you know, okay, this is the Kabuki brush. I love the Kabuki brush for blending out all my foundations, liquid, stick, spray, BB Flawless, now the concealer. The only thing I don't use this brush for is the pressed powder. I use the powder concealer brush for that. And I also use it for the concealer as well. That's that brush there. I love that. Those, these are probably my two most used foundation brushes. All right, so the Mineral Touch Liquid Foundation, you all, so easy to blend and add on additional products to. It is a liquid to powder finish, so it kind of gives me that matte finish once I'm done. I have oily combination skin, and I love the way this... Mineral Touch Liquid Foundation looks on my skin. It also doesn't smell. Have you ever had foundations that smell horrid? You're like, what kind of horrible chemicals am I putting on my face? This doesn't smell bad at all. It's mineral based and it, it wears for a really long time, especially when you wear primer and setting powder because I'm gonna go in next and I'm gonna set it with my translucent setting powder. But I just wanted to share with you the shade because I had never gotten this shade before in the liquid foundation. I just can't believe it. It's been out for a while. So there you have it. If you have any questions about the liquid foundation, please don't hesitate to ask. If you need help color matching, just say match in the comments. I'm happy to help you match. And I hope you guys have a wonderful day. I'll talk to you soon. Bye everyone.